People will be petty over all kinds of things, even what you wear on your feet. What's good, Fumble fam? Thanks for checking in with us here at The Fumble. I'm Jackie Ray. Make sure you follow me on all things social media at Jerry the Fanatic and give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Now, Dennis Schroeder played in Germany before he made his way to the Atlanta Hawks, and now he's with OKC. My guess in Germany and in Atlanta, they did not prepare him for the level of complete disdain and pettiness. Let me take that back. It's not petty. It is a warranted and forever grudge against Kevin Durant. But he learned very quickly when he laced up his Nike KDs and headed out onto the Thunder floor. The whole squad let him know that was not going to fly. Schroeder only played beside Russell Westbrook for one year, but says even he had to let him know what's up. Schroeder told The Athletic, quote, even Russ was giving me sometimes. Like, why are you wearing those? Schroeder says he wore KDs all the time growing up and he was just comfortable playing in them. But you know the man has more than one shoe. He also plays in Paul George and Kyrie's signature shoe. When people asked him why he played in KDs, his response was, bro, it's just a shoe. <laughs> you must not even know the level of beef everyone in Oklahoma holds for the man who left them to go play with a team he could not beat. But I think he's learned his lesson now. Schroeder says, quote, I had to switch something because you know, the KDs, people don't want to see them here. I was like, okay, let me go back to the Kyries. We all know the importance of a shoe. We've seen Zion's exploding shoe, and we know Lonzo had to change his big baller brand shoe during the game because they were, well, trash. If wearing KD's shoe is what makes him comfortable, I say let him wear, yeah, no, I'm lying. You can wear anything you want except KD's. Let me remind you that King James has a signature shoe as well. Although I would imagine that is going to receive some level of hate depending on where you go. I think you're good in it, OKC though. Either way, Schroeder is avoiding the situation altogether and has changed out his KD's in an effort to keep his fans on his side. Good call, Dennis. If you're an OKC fan, is there a point where you can get over the betrayal of Kevin Durant and be okay with a player rocking his gear on the court? Let me know in the comments below. Once again, I'm Jackie Ray and thanks for watching The Fumble.